Bitcoin plunged as much as 17% to its lowest level in a month as El Salvador's crypto rollout appeared to be faltering. The largest cryptocurrency fell as low as $43.050 in New York Tuesday, tumbling more than 10% in the course of an hour, before recouping about half the losses. The Bloomberg Galaxy Crypto Index, which tracks some of the largest digital tokens, lost as much as 19% at one point. Mystery sell-offs, or sell-offs where a legitimate reason is only found a significant while later are much more common in crypto than in other asset classes, said Stefan Ouellette, chief executive and co-founder of FRNT Financial. The market remains far more opaque and global than most if not all other notable asset classes. The swiftness of the plunge was likely accelerated as more than 336.000 traders had their accounts liquidated over the past 24 hours, equal to around $3. 6 billion worth of crypto, according to data from Byte, a crypto futures trading information platform. The retreat comes as Bitcoin faces one of its biggest tests in its 12-year history as El Salvador became the first country to adopt it as legal tender. The Central American nation's president, Nayib Bukele, said on Twitter that the digital wallet being used in the project can now be downloaded after it was shut down earlier because of technical glitches. The wallet, known as Chivo, comes preloaded with $30 worth of the currency for users who register with a Salvadoran national ID number. Biggest test in Bitcoin's 12-year history has a rocky first day users on platforms including Twitter and Reddit had discussed plans to buy $30 worth of Bitcoin en masse on Tuesday to mark El Salvador's law coming into effect. The potential coordinated price pump echoes previous online campaigns targeting new stocks like GameStop Corporation Bukele also said during the price slide that he was buying the dip, commenting on Twitter that 150 new coins were added and that the country now holds 550 Bitcoin. Cryptocurrency and cryptocurrencies were trending on Twitter at one point. Tuesday's sell-off is the biggest break in the rebound that had lifted Bitcoin almost 75% since late July. Other coins that had enjoyed even bigger price rallies were faring worse, Cardano lost about 15% Tuesday, while Dogecoin, the often derided joke cryptocurrency, dropped near 20%, according to traders also flagged the poor seasonality as cause of concern. In the past decade, September is the only month when Bitcoin has failed to deliver positive returns. The token fell during the calendar month in six of the previous 10 years, losing more than 6% on average, data compiled by Bloomberg show. I think it's a bit of the speculative excesses being wrung out of the system, Bloomberg Intelligence's Mike McGlone said on Bloomberg's Quick Take Stock streaming program. Ether, the second largest digital asset, also posted a drop, going from $3.900 to roughly $3.000 in a matter of minutes.